To create a hardback or paperback book at Docs Direct, we recommend preparing three PDF files in advance. Your front cover artwork, your back cover artwork, and the inside of your book. Standard A sizes work best, such as A4 or A5. To begin creating your book, click Start Now. Select whether you'd like hardback or paperback binding. I'm going to choose hardback. Clicking this will take you to the file uploader. Click Add Files to choose a PDF file to upload. We recommend uploading the inner pages of your book first and adding the front and back covers later. Click Start Upload to upload your first file. You'll then see a basic preview of your book with a blank cover. Scroll down the page to Cover Designer and click Design a Cover. You have the option to use the first and last pages of your document or to design a cover from a blank template. If you have cover artwork prepared as recommended, choose the second option and click Continue. When the cover designer loads, scroll down and click Edit on the right hand page. This is the front cover. Click Change Image to upload your front cover. Locate your front cover artwork PDF. and click Upload. Your front cover will be placed exactly where it needs to be. If you're happy with it, click Done. You can now repeat the process with the back cover. Click Edit on the left-hand page, then click Change Image. Locate your back cover artwork PDF and click Upload as before. If you're happy with how it looks, click Done. Now it's time to create the spine of your book. For a simple white spine with your book's title, click Edit to highlight the spine placeholder text and type anything you'd like to be displayed there. Make sure to stay within the guidelines represented by a rectangular box between the front and back covers. When you're done, click Done. Alternatively, if you'd prefer a coloured spine, this can be created by clicking Add a Rectangle at the top left of the cover designer. First click on Stroke. This refers to the border around the small rectangle at the top left. Most people prefer not to have this border and you can click the square with the red diagonal line to remove it. Then click Fill and choose the colour you'd like your book spine to be. When you're done, click Done. The colours in the cover designer are limited, so if you'd like a specific colour on the spine of your book, please email service at docsdirect.com after ordering. Tell us your order number and the colour reference if you have it, and we'll create a spine in the colour you need. If you're happy to use one of the colours in the cover designer, drag and drop the rectangle into place resizing it by clicking on the symbol at the bottom right of the shape. Make sure to cover the spine guidelines while avoiding overlapping the front and back cover guidelines. You'll then need to type your spine text and place it over the coloured area. First click Add Text at the top of the cover designer. Type what you'd like to be displayed on the spine. Then, highlight what you've typed and choose your preferred font options. Next, you'll need to resize and reposition your text. Rotate it 90 degrees by clicking and dragging the curved arrow symbol in the top right hand corner of the text box. Then drag the box on top of the spine. Click Edit to bring up the font options again and drag the size slider until the text reduces to a size that will fit within the spine guidelines. Click Done, then drag and drop the text box to where you want it to be. You may also want to set the colour of your spine text. To do this, click Edit again 
and choose the colour you want your text to be. When you're done, click Done. You've now finished creating your book cover. Click Finished in the top right hand corner, then click Yes to continue with your order. You'll then be taken back to the previewer, which now displays your book covers. Please note, the purpose of the previewer is to show you the positions of the pages in your book. The colours may be displayed incorrectly, as they are here, but this is nothing to worry about. To go to the checkout and complete your order, click Continue.